A week ago in Charlottesville, you saw what white supremacism means. It means white paramilitary death squads in the streets and a girl murdered by them. In your parks, you see what white supremacism means. It means vandalism. It means vandalism of your Ann Arbor parks, which your city manager just mentioned. Now, if you don't like white supremacists, if you don't like racist killers, then you shouldn't like, you shouldn't like the very big racist killer called Israel. Israel is a racist killer state. It proves it by massacring Palestinians regularly. Israel is a racist killer with hundreds of atom bombs. Israel is a racist killer that just cannot stop massacring Palestinians. And if you don't like white supremacists in Charlottesville, if you don't like white supremacists in your city parks, prove it by openly not liking the racist killers who are the Israeli government. Israel has conditioned you to accept unlimited numbers of dead Arabs as the most normal thing in the world. You need to break that conditioning and boycott Israel to the maximum extent allowed by law. Do you want us to believe that you really condemn the racist killers in Charlottesville? Then you also have to condemn the much larger racist killer called Israel, or else who is ever going to believe you? I see the city manager is smiling. I hope it's in agreement. Who will ever believe you? if you condemn racist killers in Charlottesville, but you protect them in Israel, who's going to believe you? For 15 bloody years, we have all watched Israel massacre Palestinians, and we have all watched this city council throw its weight against the boycott Israel resolution. We have stood in this Ann Arbor city council for 15 bloody years demanding that you boycott Israel to the maximum extent allowed by law. For 15 bloody years, this city council fought harder than the whole Israeli army to smother the boycott Israel resolution. So of course, Israel keeps massacring Palestinians. For 15 bloody years, you helped Israel kill thousands of Palestinians, you, the Ann Arbor City Council by forcibly blocking any public hearing on a boycott Israel resolution. By fighting so hard to protect Israel, the Ann Arbor City Council is up to its neck in Palestinian blood. It's high time you allow a hearing on the boycott Israel resolution. Thank you. Our next speaker is Muzgan Savia Sabafan. Sorry. My Sorry. name is Mojgan Savabi Astahani, and Chuck, by now you should be able to pronounce my name because I've been coming here for 15 years, and I have been speaking for Boycott of Israel. In Charlottesville, best sons and daughters of this land, best sons and daughters that this land can produce, stood against Nazis, they stood against racism, and for that they got beaten and they got killed. In Palestine, Nazi racist state of Israel kills children, young and old people, destroys their homes daily. And that work by Nazi state of Israel is supported by your tax dollars. <coughs> you are guilty. Not only that, this city council, as Blaine mentioned, has stood by Israeli genocide of Palestinian people time after time. This very room has been filled with Palestinians and other residents of Ann Arbor repeatedly chanting, demanding boycott of that Nazi racist state that is Israel. And in reply, instead of you standing against Nazis against racists, just as people did in Charlottesville, you have stood with Nazis, with, with Israeli Nazis. You have stood with them. That is only your shame. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. 
and you ought to be reminded that you have stood with Israeli Nazi state. You have stood against any public hearing and right now you look very annoyed at me because I stand for human rights. Mr. Eaton here promised us before that it will, the, the boycott resolution will never be discussed. That is to your shame, sir, Mr. Eaton. You ought to be really sh ashamed of yourself. Chuck, you yourself has, has said similar things. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Thousands of people in Palestine have been killed while you sit and stare. And you take the side of the Nazi Israelis when it comes to Palestine. Shame on you. People who gave their lives in Charlottesville would not be proud of you because they stood against fascism, they stood against Nazis, and you won't. Shame on you, Ann Arbor City Council. All of you, every one of you, you ought to be ashamed of yourself for quietly allowing the genocide of Palestinian people to go on year after year after year. Thank you. Boycott Israel.